unboxing the Steel Series Arctis Prime. If you want to check out this exact same headset, there's Amazon links below, but let's get this thing unboxed. Looks like we cut these two on the back and then this should come out. There we go. A very high quality feeling box. We have this little protective plastic cover and then overall a very nice looking headset. That is very, very pretty. I love that they continue the fabric. So the top is fabric. This piece right here that you can see, as you can see this part, this is the same fabric that's right here. So that's connected there. Uh, it's like an elastic band. But then this part that you can see there is a solid piece of metal. This entire thing is a solid piece of metal. That is a really cool design. We've seen that on other Steel Series headsets, but it doesn't get less cool. This band typically in the past has been very, very comfortable. The pads here are extremely soft. That is really quite impressive. It seems like the perfect amount of pressure uh, in terms of the foam and the faux leather itself here is actually very, very soft to the touch. That is uh, actually quite a surprise. That's very, very nice. Then here we have the mic mute switch, which is cool. It's red when it's uh, off and then that's out. It's a nice custom button that feels good. We have a volume wheel, which again has a stop there and a stop there, so it's not an infinite stop. We have a mini USB, which is interesting. I guess that's for charging. And then we have a 3.5 millimeter connection and a glossy mic, which pulls out. How is it? Ooh, that's very good. It stays exactly where you put it. And then let's see how it is to push back in. Yeah, that is really, really quite cool. Also, it looks like we have some sort of thing right there. Is that supposed to be? Yeah, so those pop off. What an interesting design, quite interesting. So I guess you could run them like that or like that. Does the other side do it too? That might be cool to customize paint. Maybe you can get different ones of these. That's very, very cool. This piece right here is all metal as well. Really the build quality here is very, very impressive and it seems like the comfort is gonna be exceptional, but let's see what else is in the box here. Ooh, we have a nice little accessory box. Wow, I love the packaging. We've got some paperwork here. We've got a 3.5 millimeter connection, which is actually the splitter, which is super, super long. I mean, this thing has gotta be like two feet long at least, that's kind of cool. This I believe is a little filter for the mic. So that's kind of cool. Let's see how that looks. Pull that out, stick that sucker right over there. Yeah, it looks kind of funky. It looks way better with this off because that just looks so nice with the glossiness. And I love that it has that accent when it's inside of it. it looks really cool. Then also in the box, we have that mini USB to 3.5 millimeter connection. And look at there, we have gloss on the end right here. That is a really nice touch. The attention to detail is quite impressive. These feel incredibly durable. They look great. You can change up the looks and probably customize these by pulling those off. Uh, overall, I am very excited to review this headset. Just based on the build quality, this looks like it's gonna be a winner. Let's see how the sound quality is with the full review. And this is the Steel Series Arctis Prime, coming in at a price tag of $49.99. These literally feel like a $150 headset, and I do mean like exactly the same. If you were to give me this and say, this is 150 bucks without using it, just looking at the build quality, I would be like, yeah, of course it's 150 bucks. The top band is completely made of metal. The ear cups are magnetic and removable. The leather at earmuffs are extremely soft and plush. There is a retractable mic that's a little bit glossy. The swiveling of the ear cups feels smooth and premium. And I could literally just keep going on and on, but this is a masterpiece of build quality for this $50 price point. It's honestly freaking wild. Not just is the build quality good, but it's also extraordinarily durable because of the very high quality materials that they use. Also the fit and finish is fantastic. No creaks, no rattles. It does not feel cheap whatsoever. All right, but that's all good and great, but how is the sound quality? Well, sound quality on these is definitely tuned more for gaming. Vocals and music aren't as emphasized and can be a bit muddy, but the mids are clear and well balanced and you do get some more bass. In game, these definitely more come to life. Higher frequencies like bullets flying past you are very crisp, footsteps are easily decipherable and explosions sound better than being more full due to that bass. For controls on the right side is a mic mute button, volume wheel, mini USB, 
3.5 millimeter connection, and then your retractable mic. For connectivity, this is wired, but it is detachable. So that's really nice. Again, feels like a more premium headset because of that. And this uses a detachable mini USB to 3.5 millimeter connection or just a 3.5 millimeter connection. So that's up to you. Now let's talk comfort. The build quality was great. So is the comfort gonna be there? And yes, it's great. I love the SteelSeries top fabric band. It makes me feel like the headset is kind of levitating. The earmuffs are soft and plush, but do not heat up over time. The only note I would say is I do get a little bit more pressure by my temples, but that's really a slight thing. And part of this is probably due to the increased weight because of the higher grade of materials. Now, as far as mic quality, the mic here is again, great. It's a bit thin and airy, but no one will have a problem understanding you. Take a listen for yourself. This is the mic test of the Steel Series Arctis Primes. Check, check, check. One, two, three. Again, if you want to check out this exact same product, there's Amazon links below for the US, UK, Canada, and international links. And if you want to check out my main channel with longer form content, you can check that out right here. But this is a consumer tech review, high speed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.